It's the daily wrap up with me, Crazy K, and today we are at the Cape Town Fashion Week Younger Sister XAFI. Let's relive the magic. Ned, which is a model agency based in Johannesburg and in Cape Town. Um, we're an agency that specializes in unique individuals, a non-traditional model agency, and um, we've been going for about 10 years. We're at XAFI, we're doing a fashion show in collaboration with XAFI. Um, it's the first time a model agency has been asked to actually do a show of people in South Africa, which I think is one of the most exciting things, especially for this genre of talent. Taking into consideration the theme for this year is a journey back home, how did you incorporate that theme into your latest collection? If you look at my collection, my looking basically has bent oranges, browns and all that. So that's the colours that I was seeing when I was home and that spoke to me in a personal way, hence why I put it in my collection. We were inspired by the journey of introspection. So home for us wasn't an actual place, it was actually a mind state. So if you look at like the collection, it was heavy with prints and the, the prints represented the mind, which was like um, a maze, which is actually the mental state that you would be in. So it's a self-inflicted prison that we create for ourselves, because we're in an era now where the zeitgeist is about mental health, there's a lot of suicide going on, and depression. So I wanted to create a collection that kind of, in a way, brings, high, highlights that. I want to tap into the Zulu, Zulu culture and or tap into both the Malawian culture, but then fuse them into one by creating looks and aesthetics that are more modern, but yet very African in terms of pattern and you know everything of that sort. So with all the collections that I'm making, I haven't really unpacked everything, I'm not gonna lie to you. I feel like with each and every year, I'm learning more things about the Malawian culture. I'm learning more things about the Zulu culture. And as I learn, I wanna take that information and interpret it into my clothing. I think Art Club and Friends is all about um, the people around me and the energies. So I think a lot of the looks, you'll see a lot of personality that uh, kind of was like inspired by people in my life. Um, we encourage the models to be themselves on the runway and to really just like feel the outfits. So I think um, just taking it back to a personal space, like why we love fashion really, it's about the people. It's called Art Club and Friends because I don't think it could exist just with me. Even though I'm, I started it, there's a lot of people that play a big role in, um, in its growth and where it is today and Mzwandile is one of them. I'm glad I met her because I really appreciate her. Like, I appreciate her presence in my life. She doesn't see me as just a business partner, but also like a little brother to her. So that means really like a lot for me. And I see a great relationship with me and Robin. What an incredible day it's been here at Experience AFI. We've unearthed new talent, seen lots of creations, and what better way to end off such a day than the performance from the King of Cotton himself, Ricky Rick. The next time you see me, I'll be on the red carpet, dressed to the nines.